You're watching CNA Heroes. Here's Lisa Sweet. Welcome to CNA Heroes. I'm Lisa Sweet, co-founder of the National Association of Healthcare Assistants. As always, thank you for taking the time to watch these segments about extraordinary people using their love, skills, and compassion to change the world one resident or one patient at a time. This episode of CNA Heroes is actually twice as special because it's not just about one CNA, but two CNA superstars. Kai and Ava Serwinski are a brother and sister, Irish twins, some call them, as they're less than one year apart in age. They are from small town America, Grove, Oklahoma. They come from a family of healthcare. Their father is a nurse turned nurse anesthetist. Their mother, older sister and grandmother, all nurses, and their grandfather, a pharmacist. So these two have been around healthcare settings a lot while they were growing up. In 2019, encouraged by their mother, Kelly, Ava enrolled in CNA classes and was soon joined by her brother, Kai, at her urging. Kelly thought it would be a great start to a healthcare or medical career for her kids, providing great life experience. Kelly said huge life lessons are learned in taking care of those who can't take care of themselves. The elderly seem forgotten by this generation. Their mother continued to say, I love the compassion and empathy they have gained by doing this. If they decide to go into medicine or nursing, they will have firsthand experience. Sounds like a wise mother. So school started as usual at Grove High School, and when football season was over, Kai went to work as a CNA at Grove Nursing Center. This would have been the fall of 2019. Both teens, Kai and Ava, were engaged in sports and extracurricular activities. Both Ava and Kai were looking forward to completing the spring 2020 semester at Grove High School, each having a great deal riding on final state sports competitions and, of course, those final months Kai looked forward to as a high school senior with all the traditions and celebration that we can all remember. But everything changed March 12th. The state basketball tournament was canceled and little did they know that would be the last day of in-person classes for the academic year. The district quickly started transitioning to online learning. While Ava quarantined at home doing her schoolwork, Kai picked up double shifts at the nursing home. In April, Grove Nursing Center, like so many nursing homes across the country, started waging a battle with COVID-19 within their walls. All residents and employees were tested and before it would be over, 50 residents and 28 staff members had tested positive for the virus and at the end, 17 residents would have died. Even in the face of COVID-19, young Kai continued his work even more determined. As residents became sicker and many of his coworkers became ill and missed work, Kai urged his sister to join him in the good fight. After all the phone calls and procedures, Ava officially joined the team as a CNA, working three to 11, Monday through Saturday. Kai continued to work double shifts on the weekends, and he worked 3 to 11, Tuesday through Thursday, with the occasional Friday added in. I think that's a seven-day work week. The work is much more than a job to these siblings. Ava says that they are there to bring extra love and a listening ear, in addition to all the job duties as a CNA. Their role on the team was just as vital as the others, despite their young age. There was no time to ease them into the work as each of them has already provided post-mortem care after losing a resident. Kai said, 
It sucks because the family can't come see them. For me, it feels like they really don't get to say goodbye. Those are wise words from such a young person. Ava said she knew the day one of the facility's special residents died would be incredibly, incredibly difficult for Kai. Ava said my heart sunk because I knew how he talked about her. Ava said she met her and she was vibrant and fun. The experience from working at the nursing home during this historical pandemic has strengthened both Kai and Ava's conviction to pursue medical careers. Kai as a surgeon or dermatologist and Ava as a nurse. And now, here we are in the fall of 2020. I'm sure Kai has gone off to college and Ava has started her senior year at Grove High School. Although their tenure at Grove Nursing Center wasn't lengthy, they stepped up and served when they were needed most. They didn't run away from the hard work and the threat of a deadly virus. They ran toward it to help others in need. What a lesson we can learn from these beautiful young people. And that is why they are this week's CNA Heroes. Everyone, please join me in recognizing these young, brave, loving, and hardworking individuals, Kai and Ava Serwinski, CNA Heroes. Thank you.